Janelle Evans' husband, David Eason, is seriously losing it. His behavior just keeps getting weirder and weirder, and it seems like things are getting really bad for him all of a sudden, for some pretty crazy reasons, and now it's starting to cause concern for the safety of Janelle and their kids. Before we break down the latest crazy news about David, it's helpful to know what's been happening leading up to it. Over the past several weeks, he and Janelle had been making headlines for all the wrong reasons. In August, she even publicly called him out for being toxic and manipulative in a shocking Facebook post. Janelle explained that she was stuck in her marriage to David, and accused him of being seriously damaging to her mental health. She called him a user and pretty much claimed that she wanted nothing to do with him, but what happened next was seriously insane. All of this was just a few days before Janelle's son Jace ran away for the first time. But after he ran away for the second time, Janelle completely changed her tune about David for a terrible reason. There have been multiple reports claiming that, due to Jace reportedly running away, Janelle and David are being investigated by Child Protective Services. Now Janelle is acting like they're happier than ever and everything is totally fine. But how David is behaving is seriously troubling. Recently, he's been going on live on TikTok more often than ever before. It honestly seems like he's randomly live streaming at all hours of the day, which is suspicious in itself. It's really odd that David is always live streaming by himself when there are three or four kids of his and Janelle's children at home. But let's be real, it might be for the best that he's not around the kids because what he's been doing on TikTok live is truly unbelievable. In some of David's recent live streams, he seemed to be under the influence of adult beverages and other substances. In one video, he and Janelle were just hanging out in their shed while they both used substances. That's what makes his behavior even more concerning. David has also been waving a huge variety of his firearms around during his live stream. It's no secret that he has a stash of firearms on the land since he carries one almost everywhere he goes. But what he's been saying while showing them off lately is genuinely terrifying. In one of David's TikTok lives, a commenter called him a poser. In response, he grabbed a few different firearms arms and started bowing off about which one he would use if he actually were a poser. But that's not the only thing he's been doing that proves he's becoming totally unhinged. Believe it or not, David has also been promoting the recent launch of his rap career. But as I'm sure you already guessed, he's been doing that in a very alarming way. In a strange video that David shared on all of his social media accounts, he talked about the single he's since released, Please Don't Make Me. He was completely camouflaged as he walked through the woods toward the camera and what he said was so crazy. David called himself a country boy who suddenly became famous, which is actually pretty funny. He's really only known for being married to Janelle and everyone basically hates him, but his explanation for what his first rap song would be about was seriously scary. David revealed that he would be rapping about how he's planning to protect his country, way of life, as well as his family. First off, I don't think he really understands that no one is trying to disrupt his way of life without good reason. Why would anybody want to deal with David and his anger issues if they didn't have to. I mean, even Janelle admitted to not wanting to be around his negativity. There wouldn't be any person or department looking into him if there weren't legitimate concerns about the children's safety. Secondly, David's means of protecting his lifestyle and his family are clearly super unsettling. During another one of his TikTok lives, someone commented and directly asked him what the meaning of his song was. His answer was unbelievably sketchy. David claimed that Please Don't Make Me is about him telling people not to make him use use a firearm on someone. That's already an insanely disturbing mindset to have. But now that the song has been released, David's lyrics expose exactly how dangerous he is. In the song, he's very clear about what he plans to do if anyone steps foot on his property. Apparently, he wouldn't even warn a person before ending their life with one of his countless firearms. If that's not awful enough, David mentions using firearms and ending people's lives several other times throughout the song. Considering his criminal record, history of DV, and how he angrily ended the life of the family, dog a few years ago, his lyrics are horrifying. In 2018, David was fired by MTV for his homophobic Twitter rant where he disgustingly compared members of the LGBTQ community to dogs. A year later, he used a firearm to end the life of the family dog, which resulted in one of the times he lost custody of his kids. At the time, David and Janelle did whatever they could to save their reputations. But during an interview with People Magazine, Janelle made a ridiculous comment while defending her dangerous husband. She claimed that nobody outside of their family should have found out about what happened to their poor French bulldog, but she was actually the person who posted about it on social media and told her friends. A private family issue that happened within our household and we didn't want it getting it out in the news at all, of course. Janelle said that David understood that people have fears about firearms, but then she made a weirdly dismissive remark. He hunts, he fishes, 
and you know, the way he was raised is really different. Janelle explained that David has always had a very country lifestyle, which is why he decided to end their dog's life with a firearm. But instead of realizing how truly messed up that was, she turned it around on everyone else. They just don't understand it from David's perspective. I'm sorry, but I really don't think that David should be given a pass just because of his rural upbringing. Not to mention, that wasn't the only time he ended an animal's life on the land. Two years ago, Lil Ensley exposed her father's true colors during one of his TikTok live. In one of David's live streams from 2021, he and then four-year-old Ensley were checking on the chickens. At the time, a lot of baby chicks had recently hatched, but what Ensley said had happened the day before completely caught everyone off guard, including David. Ensley told David not to end any of the other baby chicks' lives like he had the previous day. He was obviously stunned, but tried to play it off like she had no clue what she was talking about, but she wouldn't back down. Ensley then said that she would be so mad at David if he used his firearm again to end the lives of any other baby chicks. When he asked her why she would say something so crazy, she replied that he had really done it. And that was when things took an even more shocking turn. David clearly knew that he couldn't keep denying what he'd done, so instead of ending the live, he warned his own daughter to stop talking or he would physically harm her. It's insane that David is still allowed to be around his kids, especially considering his shady past and his pattern of ending the lives of animals. Now that he's threatening to do the same with people, you think Janelle wouldn't want to risk her or her children's well-being being, but she still stays with him despite knowing everything he's capable of and just how dangerous he is. Not surprisingly, Janelle is defending David and his creepy song. She even explained in a Facebook comment that it's brought them closer together. She claimed that she wanted him to be more motivated and do something with his life, and that's what he's doing. So not only is Janelle sticking by her husband after all the dirty laundry she just aired out about him, but she's also clearly supporting him and his troubling beliefs even though people seem more concerned than ever about him being around their kids. David's recent behavior online is incredibly troubling, and the threats he made in his song are equally as worrisome. But based on his disturbing history, he isn't going to stop or change himself for the better. If this is what David feels comfortable showing to the world, I hate to imagine what's really going on behind closed doors. Hopefully Janelle, the kids, and everyone else who has to be involved with him are safe. But now that we've covered everything about David's alarming behavior and his new rap song, I'm curious, are you surprised by his concerning lyrics and how he's been acting during his live streams? What are your thoughts on how supportive Janelle has been on David despite the negative impact he could potentially have on their children? Let me know in the comments below.